Well, I gotta finally break down and get some new glasses, get an eye exam, all that good stuff. Broke my glasses, I've had these glasses for like five years. <laughs> Way too long. Probably good I broke them. But, uh, yeah, I've been doing more tinkering, man. It's cold here now, so indoor activities. You might remember this is my XR10 crawler. And I have stolen all the good stuff off the front of it. Okay, all that really expensive steering stuff. And I stuck it on my piece of crap AX10 here, which I love and I drive all the time. So we got the just a big chunks of aluminum all over it now. I love it. VPC hubs, VP knuckles. Get my nice stainless steel link up there. The, got the deluxe knuckle weights. Got the RC Bros weight hangers. Got the VP SLW wheels. The shaved white dot rovers, which have cutting discs on the sides. These are like foam discs on both sides this time. I'm going to try them on the front with both sides and the large foam. And we'll see how that works for me. The beauty of this is that I have so much steering now. I have more steering than I can actually use. I have to set my EPAs back just a little bit so I'm not rubbing stuff. And since this isn't a strictly like a rock crawler, I'm not super concerned about uh, clearance. The main clearance is my basher bar, light bar thing, which is ugly and weird looking, but without it, I would be smashing my servo horn every time I hit something. So this is, this is a good thing. I'm going to keep this on here until it breaks in half. <laughs> So, yeah, a little bit of tinkering. So you can see I got the nice wheels on it now. The other wheels, I think, are actually lighter than these wheels. So, it's not necessarily a good thing. It's just sort of a necessary thing because of the way these um, wheel weights and knuckles and stuff work. It's good to have the, uh, with these little hub adapters in here. They're made by Lattice Innovations called Shift. You can space them in and out and get everything set up the way you want. But that is a really, really crazy amount of steering now. I wasn't real happy with the actual geometry of the other steering. I, I messed with it as much as I could and I just didn't like it. It just didn't, it just didn't work well. It wasn't just that there wasn't enough steering angle, it was just shitty geometry, just, I don't know, just something not right about it. So this will be way better. I've done a little indoor testing, but this thing really gets hot when I drive it around on the carpet, so I'll test it more outside tomorrow. Alright, that's it. Freaking blind carpenter needs glasses. Must tinker without them. <laughs> <laughs> All right.